beloved, this is Evangelist Gloria Marjorie coming to give you the words of Jesus. And just take a listen, beloved. And it came to pass that on one of those days, as he taught the people in the temple and preached the gospel, the chief priests and scribes came upon him with the elders and spake unto him, saying, Tell us. By what authority doest thou these things? And who is he that gave thee this authority? And he answered and said unto them, I will also ask you one thing and answer me. The baptism of John, was it from heaven or of men? And they reasoned with themselves, saying, If we shall say from heaven, he will say, Why then believed you him not? But and if we say of men, all the people will stone us, for they be persuaded that John was a prophet. And they answered that they could not tell whence it was. And Jesus said unto them, Neither tell I you by what authority I do these things. And also, and they asked him, saying, Master, we know that thou sayest and teachest rightly, neither acceptest thou the person of any, but teachest the way of God. Is it lawful for us to give tribute unto Caesar or no? But he perceived their craftiness and said unto them, Why tempt he me? Show me a penny, whose image and superscription hath it? They answered and said, Caesar's. And he said unto them, Render therefore unto Caesar the things which be Caesar's, and unto God the things which be God's. And they could not take hold of his words before the people, and they marveled at his answer and held their peace. And also, then said the Lord of the vineyard, what shall I do? Because this is um, a man planted a vineyard and led it forth to a husband man and went into a folk country for a long time. In the season he sent a servant to the husband men that they should give him of the fruit of the vineyard. But the husbandmen beat him and sent him and were empty. And again he sent another servant. They beat him also and entreated him shamefully and sent him away empty. And again he sent a third and they wounded him also and cast him out. Then said the Lord of the vineyard, what shall I do? I will send my beloved son. It may be they will reverence him when they see him. But when the husbandmen saw him, they reasoned among themselves, saying, This is the heir. Come, let us kill him that the inheritance may be ours. So they cast him out of the vineyard and killed him. What therefore shall the Lord of the vineyard do unto them? He shall come and destroy these husbandmen and shall give the vineyard to others. And when they heard it, they said, God forbid. And he beheld them and said, What is this? Then that is written, The stone which the builders rejected, the same is become the head of the corner. Whosoever shall fall upon that stone, shall be broken, but on whomsoever it shall fall, it will grind him to powder. And the chief priests and the scribes, the same hour sought to lay hands on him, and they feared the people, for they perceived that he had spoken this parable against him. They watched him and sent for spies, which could feign themselves just men that they might take hold of his words, so they might deliver him under the power and authority of the governor. Love it. This is the word of the Lord and how they tormented Jesus. And so Jesus answered them and they could not understand. Because he said to them, Render therefore unto Caesar the things which be Caesar's and unto God the things which be God's. Love it. This is the word of the Lord. How Jesus dealt with them and they tried to tempt him. So next time, beloved, God bless you.